six. This is Rob G. All right, so we, I don't know if some of you ever heard of uh, wish.com. Um, it's uh, one of those uh, Chinese websites where you can get all these products from China and they'll ship them for, to you. You know, they, you'll get them at really, you know, cheap crap. You know, you, most of it's cheap crap anyway. Um, and get it delivered to your door. Um, Timu is a is one of them. It's like a wish.com, but it's an app. I think they have a website as well. But what we have here today is I saw Timu and I saw the items that they had, and uh, I couldn't resist. I had to I had to try it out. You know, they gave you like some obscene, you know, fifty dollars off. You know, of uh, you know, some coupon for fifty dollars off on your first item of fifty dollars or more. So obviously, I went ahead and grabbed these uh, night vision binoculars. Uh, and this is I just got this today, and this is how it looks. Yeah, and that cheapy package traveling overseas. You know, getting all beat up here. Yeah, there's a scuffle there. Yeah, it's, it looks like it's been banged around. Yeah. And I tried these before, yeah. Uh, came from uh, Shitang Avenue West, Gong, Gongzhou City. I don't know. Can't really read that. But it's a it's a night vision binocular. Uh, it has uh, a 10 megabyte still image uh, resolution. 5 megs and 3 megs VG. I'm just reading the, the specs here. If you can see them there, if you like, I can zoom in there. There we go. All right, so video, it does, uh, it's a HD 1920 by 1080p um, LCD screen. So it does pretty good video. Uh, zoom is five times digital zoom. Storage, uh, it it can have up to 128, accept 128 gigs. Uh, file formats is JPEG, videos, and MP4. Um, full black observation distance is anywhere from five millimeters to 800 millimeters. So I'm not entirely sure what that means. Low light or daytime observation distance is five meters to infinity. Okay. Uh, has a strong infrared spotlight. It says uh, seven speed infrared adjustment. Okay. Uh, USB interface type C for recharging the built in lithium ion battery. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Let's crack it open. Hopefully, it works. Just kidding, guys. I tested it out before the video. It does work. Okay, so we have a little user manual. Uh, yeah, tells you how to turn it on, yada, 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 change the modes. Yeah, take pictures. I'll turn it off, cleaning it, and of course in Chinese. Okay, we have a little cleaning cloth for the lens. Little Type C USB charger cable. Comes with a lanyard. Definitely be putting that on because you don't want to drop them and break them on first try there. Uh, what is this? A little SD card, uh, micro SD, 64 gigs, eh, not bad. What is this? Uh, USB, oh, to transfer your videos to the computer. All right, so we'll be going, go ahead and record the video and I'll be making it part of this uh, product review. It's in bubble wrap, Let's see if there's anything else in there. Nope, comes with a little case there. All right. Got the IR there, and video, video, video there. Standard lens. Snap picture. This is your mode. IR plus, IR minus. Power button in the middle. And that's your LCD screen. And that's your battery, battery port area. And it does have a little. Uh, area where you can screw in a tripod. That's cool. Let's uh, strap on on that lanyard first. 
before we go try this out. I don't trust my hands. There we go. Do this right. go got the lanyard up go ahead and turn it on welcome all right that's a little bright there uh, okay so obviously we're too close to items there it does say HD there on top uh, no memory card let me go ahead and Add that memory card. Uh, memory card is right here on the side. And so is the charging. Go ahead and add that in there. Goes in upside down, I guess. And kind of sticks out there. Let's see if that worked. Yep. Okay. It's a little hard to see here. All right. I'm going to do some video on it. Um, obviously, you're not going to pick up anything because all the lights are on. Even if I turn them off in here. Don't think you're going to get anything. Let me try. Turned off all the lights here. Back that up. All right, looks like it's standard video. Doesn't look IR at the moment. Let me go ahead and, there we go. That's your IR there. It is black and white. Not entirely sure you can see it there. So as you can see down there, the butt stock of the rifle is pitch black. Let's see if we can pick it up there. Yeah, the camera lens is not going to pick it up. So this is Guncraft Sim 6. I'm trying out the uh, IR night vision goggles. That's in my attic on my garage. It is pitch black. I can't see anything. I'm in my garage. There is a zoom on here, a focus. And I'm too close to the items here. There's a gas tank right in front of me. And I can't even see it, not one bit. It's pitch black. Some golf clubs up there. Let me focus in. Some golf clubs. Oh, look at that. There's some seeds, seed well. Boxes up in the attic. Pitch back back there. I can't see it. Put the IR on here and fix it up pretty nice and just focus in. Really nice. Peach tree over there. Those, that's a light on in the back. But in the corner there, I can't see anything. The naked eye. Pitch black, can't see anything. 
cannot see anything with the naked eye. At most, I can see that there's a tanner back there, just barely. tree there. That's a uh, pomegranate. There's five different peaches on that tree. But, yep. I can't even see that black bench back there. So awesome. So this is a test of the night vision goggles.